The Tejas Mark II, expected to be unveiled at Aero India 2023, is going to replace the aging fleets of MiG-29, Mirage 2000 and Jaguars in the Indian Air Force. The Defence Research and Development Organization's timeline envisions the aircraft's first flight to take off by December 2024. By 2027, at least four prototypes are expected to be built and the fighter jets are expected to join the IAF before the end of this decade. The aircraft can integrate a variety of weapons including those from Russia, France and Western countries as well as those developed indigenously by India's Defence Research and Development Organisation as well. The variant also features widened wings and can carry the scalp bomb weighing around 1350 kg. The Mark II is maintenance friendly and has a range of 570 km and can quickly change roads with an air to air configuration, allowing for a 30 minute takeoff and 45 minutes for the air to ground. It will be powered by a more powerful GE F414 INS6 engine. Now, however, the Tejas program has faced significant criticisms, with the most notable being the prolonged development timelines and the reliance on imported engines for the LCA Mark I and Mark II. Currently, both LCA Mark I and Mark II rely on engines from the United States, despite efforts to accelerate the development on an indigenous, high-powered engine, industry experts predict that it is unlikely for India to achieve this goal by the end of the decade. Like the Mark I variant, the Mark II will also be relying on an engine that is not indigenously produced. This brings to the fore another major point of criticism, the stalled development of the Kaveri engine that was supposed to power the LCA 